The man who turned a soup can into art is dead. Warhol, guru of pop art, has died in New York. He died in hospital the day after a gallbladder operation. The director of New York's Museum of Modern Art described Warhol tonight as a serious artist who pretended to be unserious. He said Warhol's paintings were like a meadow in the middle of Manhattan. Everything about Andy Warhol had an air of unreality and uncertainty. There were doubts about his age, some were just under 60, and for a lot of people, just as many doubts about the artistic value of his works. The most famous of those were his pictures of the Campbell's soup can. I'd been eating soup for 20 years, so I painted it, he said. Many in the art world said Warhol was a genius for immortalizing the facts and the myths of daily life and called it pop art. For his silk screens, he set up the so-called factory in New York, which later turned its hand to avant-garde filmmaking. He seemed to laugh at his own work. I guess everybody paints the same picture over and over again anyway, so... So you could have stuck with the soup tins and the Brillo boxes? And... Well, just as soup can. That would have denied us an awful lot of your more successful paintings, then, images. Well... No, then people were just less to think about. He made those comments last year in London at an exhibition purely composed of self-portraits. And there's no doubt that in becoming the best-known modern artist since Picasso, he showed that one of his greatest talents was for keeping the world fascinated by Andy Warhol. The American artist Andy Warhol, who died today in New York. The SDB president...